it's, it's almost like how we talk about money, right? We talk about how, like, yo, when you get money, like, when you finally are financially free, right, and stable, you can now focus on other aspects of your mm-hmm. life, right? You can focus mm-hmm. on other growths of your life. You can. You get me? Because you're no longer, like, stressing about, oh, I got to go the work and get this money. Whatever, exactly. Yeah. You know, you can now, you can mm-hmm. stand for something. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You can fight for something. You can be something more. You know what I mean? Than just a worker. Trying to get by. Yeah. Exactly. So it's, it's, it's the same thing with the girl. Like, if the girl or myself or someone who's in the same place, if you don't get to a point where you can deal with that issue, then you're always going to be, that's going to be more than enough for you. I mean, like, like just having a guy, that, that guy might treat you like shit. He might not really mm-hmm. ride for you like that. There might be somebody out there way better for you, but you will never get there yeah. because you didn't deal with the first problem that you should have dealt with in the first place. You mm-hmm. get what I'm saying? And that's, that's just learned behavior. That's programming. You yeah. came up, you don't realize these things. You have it within you. And now you're old. You start to realize some things. Now you get to a place where you got to try to fix them. And yeah. that's that's um. Uh, go ahead, go ahead. No, sir. no. I, I think uh, I think you're hitting it like right on the head. Um, I do think there's there's this idea where a lot of times we excuse ourselves, saying that's just how things are, or that's yeah. just how I am. Yeah. Um, uh, because we don't want to label certain things. Like for example, you know, someone who has father issues, right, or parental issues, mm-hmm. you know, they have abandonment issues, so they'll settle for a bad, abusive relationship yeah. as long as they don't leave. Because, yeah, you know, the yeah. fear of dad left me or mom left yeah, me, right? Uh, exactly. Or, or someone who's never really received the uh, affirmation is just looking for anybody to tell them, you know, they're beautiful, or mm-hmm. they're handsome or whatever. Yeah. You know, thinking that whether that's money or success or whatever is going to mm-hmm. bring, you know, those compliments they never received, right? And so I, I would say, I think we all need therapy. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. but I think, um, and I think a lot of times has to be, you know, maybe there is a profession of you can afford a profession, that'd be awesome. Yeah. But if not, you know, friendships around seeing people uh, model the life you want, you yeah. know, or, or the, you know, and I don't mean the material, I mean more in, in the personality, in the charisma, in the confidence, yeah, yeah. In, in the uh, relational and mental health, mm-hmm. right? Like uh, seeing that, model that of somebody who came out of similar things is often the encouragement we need right yeah. like you know uh, you can see somebody who came out of the uh, the hood and and the broken home and whatever and have a fulfilled marriage yeah you know you can see a, a father who didn't have a father you can see a mother who didn't have a mother right yeah um they're not gonna be perfect because i think a lot of things we do carry and until we don't examine why we do what we do in every area right yeah. we're gonna keep carrying it yeah. But there is uh, that progress where, you know, I'm not going to be who I saw, who the X and Y is. You know, I could be them because that would be the easy way out. Yeah. But I'm going to have the mental fortitude to say, you know, I'm going to shift my future and the future right, of right. the generations to come. Yeah. And I think that, that that's what marks someone with, with uh, a certain, you know, desire to just be different right mm-hmm. those are the kind of people that we say oh you know those are world changers those are influential people yeah, yeah, yeah. people who don't conform to the ways of the world or mm-hmm. anybody else they they choose a better path